Hello, everybody, and congr- I'm so happy for us. We've made it to episode 10. Go, pull digits. We're finally on double digits. You know the drill. Great deathmatch. Easy mode. Ignore the fact that I don't have a thousand coins. You know why. Oh, and uh, I'm sorry about the no audio thing. Uh, the recording had a bug, and it it took a while to fix, but if you can hear this, then it's fixed. But anyway, I today, you're like, well, why didn't you just re-record it? Well, I posted it before I knew. And also, I hate this creature, and I don't want to play as it again. So we're going to try this out. It's supposed to be really fast, and it has an ability with sword on contact. You're just scaled by your velocity. So I can go fast and just zoom into things. Interesting, interesting, interesting. But we're gonna have to do very well with all of this. But next episode, like, we're getting into the pretty big, scary creatures. Like... I'm gonna have to kill the Great White Shark at some point. But, right now, sailfish, let's get into it. Okay, we're here, and we are fast. And, yes, we are fast, but there's also a lot of fast creatures out here. Yeah. Go! Make a run for it! Oh, that was dangerous. Well, at least now we're in a safer area. We have starfish. I do 1.2 damage on base level. That's not amazing. How about my XP gain? Uh, okay, so here we go. We're gonna need like five starfish for the first level. Okay, that's doable. Yeah, that spawn location, not great. Like, that was... If I had not seen those guys that quickly and reacted, I would not have gotten out of that situation. Delicious. This is actually not a bad spot. And plus, we're making my money back. Hopefully, in this episode, we can get back up to a thousand, which is the maximum. But, hey. Maybe this hillfish- and also, why when I spawned in, I didn't have my sail all the way up? Why was I- yeah, what, why does that keep happening? Why is it going down and going back up? Let me know in the comments if you know what's happening. I can sailfish in real life- I think they can put their sails down. But I don't know why- like, I'm not doing anything that should make it do that. Okay, so, those guys over there are the exo... the fish. I don't remember what they're called, but I do remember that they start with an X and I cannot pronounce it. And that they're very strong and powerful when I hate them. But now we're level 2, and we are quite fast. And we're also, like, this is a fish you want to catch when you're fishing. Like, this is what you want to catch. Like, this is a big deal when you catch it. I think it's also illegal. That's why it's such a big deal. Let's see, do we have any starfish? There you are. Now, I'm curious to see about this ramming into things, so do I just, like, super speed run into stuff and I do, like, a hundred million damage? Like, how does that work? Oh, and also, um, episode eight got like, 16,000 views, um... So, is it- is the reason you guys like that since it's kind of a creature nobody really plays because you have to beat one of the bosses to play as it? Is that why? Like, I, I'm just not sure I understand. Like, I'm happy, but like, it's scary. Because I don't know if I'm ever going to be able to make content that good again. But hey, if you guys- if you guys keep watching the videos, watch until the end. I'll keep making them. And also, you're like, 
Oh, it's so easy. You're playing on easy mode. Well, how I'm going to do it is I'm going to go through every creature on every map on easy mode and then go through and play them again on medium mode. Now, I know that sounds like a very long thing, but here's the deal. I want this... Oh, level three. I want this, like, series of Feeding for Fish to go on for a long time because no one makes videos on this game or doesn't make many more except for small YouTubers and I want to turn it into something big. Yeah, that did four damage. That did four big damage. Yeah. 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 Kill the stupid. Yeah. Yeah. One win it. One win it. Ah. Yeah. All right. So that's how it works. You guys kind of gotta run in and click the attack button. I thought these guys were weaker than they than this one was. Eh. They got quite a bit of health actually. Uh, 19. Okay, that wasn't worth it. That took a lot of damage. Uh, I'm far enough away. I'm good. I'm good. I'm just very scared of those fish. Like, I may be- I think I'm one of the fastest fish in the game. Or, sorry, I, I think I am. Actually, I think this is- yeah, this is probably the fastest fish in the game. Because it would make sense because this is one of the fastest just creatures in the planet. On the planet. God. Or technically also in the planet. You know, there's animals inside the planet. Like worms and stuff. Oh, uh, yeah. Also, I have a question. Would you all want me to play the Crab Mania? Like, after I'm done with all of these creatures, would you guys want me to go in on this map and play the Crab Mania? And do all the crabs? And also, what map is next? Well, like, we only have, I think, maybe eight, maybe ten episodes left, so, like, double what we've done. And I'm sorry for uh, last weekend I didn't make any videos. It was Easter weekend, and it was very busy. I didn't have time to record anything. Or edit anything, for that matter. Alright, we get up here. And then we crawl on over here. Where it's safe enough. Alright, this should bring us to level 4. Well, let's see. Can I... Oh, I'm stuck. There we go. Level 4. We're quite large. I wonder if I was at max speed and range of the Megalodon on this thing of, like, level 10 or 15. I'd probably do enough damage to kill it in, like, two hits. That's my personal way of thinking. So, how do I put my fin up? Oh, if I'm not moving, it goes up. Well, that doesn't make sense. That's how they go fast, is with the fin. Or isn't that how they turn quickly? Oh, my turning speed is magnificent. Oh, I like this fish. I know its stats aren't amazing, except how fast it is. Whee! But its maneuverability is just excellent. Like... I can... Welcome to the carousel. Um... I don't even actually know where the Great White Shark is on the map. I'm not even sure. Oh, that's the ice area. We don't want to go there. Dive, dive, dive. Oh, I did so much damage. I don't like how weird color the water gets, see? Like, right over here. It gets all blue and depressing. I'm trying to find more safe things to eat. Let's 
Oh, and also, if you're wondering, well, you asked us what map you we should I should play on next, but you didn't tell us the options. Well, there is. I'll say them from easy to hard. This is probably the easiest one. I'm not going to lie. Then after that, I'm pretty sure it's the reef map. I think this is this is the great map. But the reef map is, is it's very similar, has almost all the same features. I think it has a couple other ones and a couple less of these. But still playing as the same creature on a different map, they'll spawn in different areas and stuff, so it'll make it it'll make it a different experience. All that means is that we'll understand how to use the creature beforehand. Starfish hiding. Drawing us all that. You're just like yelling at me to get the starfish. Yeah, episode 8 was pretty fun, you know? Getting to go on land. Like, I could escape anything just jumping on land. Goodbye, Dory. Oh, starfish. Quit falling. I'm trying to eat you. No! It's like whenever you are like are really excited and you got like a good piece of candy in your hand, and you accidentally drop it and you can't eat it anymore, and you're just like, life is ruined. Like that is one of the most upsetting things. Like whenever you get something really good to eat and then you just drop it and you're just like, life is over. It's ruined. Life is ruined. Like, that's how it feels sometimes. The thing is, there's always more candy. Okay, we're level 5, and we are very large. Like, I am a excellent catch at this point. And I am fast. Still. Like, you know, like, when you evolve the creatures, they usually get slower? Is that a turtle? I'm pretty sure that's a turtle. Okay. So we know what to do. We move in slowly, slowly. We're trying to eat my food. Yeah. Yeah. Get away! Get away from my num nums. Got it. Yeah, they let the sea turtles AI makes them eat these things. I'm gonna bite your butt off. Yeah. Honestly, this turtle might give me some good meat, so I may kill it, honestly. Oh, there's another one. Wait, this is it. This is the area where they spawn. I did not... Wait, no, it's not. This is different. There's two areas where they spawn. Guys, if you're wondering if this is annoying for me as well. Yes, it is. Okay, that was five damage. Seven damage. Okay, that's good damage. That's good damage. Hey, you're not going anywhere. Bucko. I'm trying to escape. <laughs> Got him! Uh, uh, uh. I'm getting him! Uh, uh. Man, I did not do enough damage. Well, like, I do more than 2.5 damage, but he has a resistance factor that makes it harder to kill him. Man, I wish I could play as a sea turtle. This is probably how it would go. <clears throat> Did the six damage. We're gonna kill a stupid sea turtle. <clears throat> gotta get him in the crit chains. It's like Minecraft. Gotta get him in. Gotta get him in the crit chains. I can see he's taking a lot of damage. Yeah! 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 Yes! It's finally unconscious. Now I just have to hit it a lot. Just, just get it. Just get it dead. I'm trying. 
I, you can, you can, I don't know if the recording is picking up my mouse clicking, but I'm clicking my mouse a lot. Oh, man. Hopefully this will get me to level 6. <sighs> probably not, and I probably wasted a lot of time. But, it wouldn't be one of my videos without killing a turtle. Because... I don't know, somehow I always end up killing turtles. Um, how does one kill the sea turtle? I'm trying so hard. Oh my god. Whoa! Whoa! Um, okay. Uh... What happened to my meat? Kidding me? Uh, you're joking, right? I think that's it right there. Better not be any in creep shows on because I'll kill them. Okay, I don't know what just happened, but nothing good. Uh, okay. Alright, that was level 6. Okay. That actually worked. But I don't know if I have another one of those in me. That was a little painful. But there is another starfish. Oh, I'm only have to two hit them now. Can I just eat them? Okay, yeah, I can. That's a lot faster. I'm just eating them for 60 XP. May not be as good as my- I think- Actually, it may be better XP. I'm not sure. But I, it, it's so much faster. Like, I just have to find them and... Okay, this one's... I think this one's a bigger one, so I can't eat it yet. Actually, I think that's the same, because they have five arms in the center part. They each gave me 10 XP, that's 60. Okay, we got another one of these guys. Hold on. Hold on, hold on. Let me back up. That was a damage. That was pretty solid damage. Uh, that was emotional damage. And this guy is pretty solid meal. I remember the episode that we played of this. Didn't go too well. Because this creature is not great. What was that? Episode 3? Oh, episode 10? I want to say 10. But I, I, I just... I feel like I'm going to be so embarrassed if I'm wrong. We're getting closer to level 7. <sighs> I do need to try and take on something a little bit stronger, but... You know, like... Like I need to make my money back. Like, I've already made my money back on this creature. This creature? Worth it. Worth it all a struggle. But... Black Tip Shark, just, just don't. Just spend your... Spend your points... Your coins on this. It's much better. Maybe a little bit more, I think. I think this is 40. 40 is quite a lot. But all the creatures, some of the ones we have coming up are going to be hundreds. And I intend to make multiple hundreds back. Alright, couple more starfish. Let's just scoop them up. Scoop. Scoop a doop. Scooped. I just had to go away for a little bit and all the stuff regenerated around here. Scoop. Level 8. Oh, I have to eat this one. Ah! You got it. And another one? This is just the farm. Like, there's two more. Like, what? Three more. Bite, bite, slur. I 
Actually, sorry, I was wrong. There was five here. Six. Okay, that got me to level nine. That's nice. Okay. Oh my god. Bruh. There's no way I'm slower than that, right? I gotta be faster. Why didn't either any of you tell me that that's where the Pronabadon hangs out? Holy crap! You guys needed to warn me about that! Oh god! That thing would have killed me! Oh man! That was such a good spot, too. Maybe I'm safe here. God, the Prognathodon was right there. Oh, that's not okay. There. Oh, I have that. Oh, that's comforting. The giant blue open ocean. Do I have a fear of the ocean from this game? I think the answer to that is yes. I just don't like how you can't see anything. Oh, yep, this is definitely the place I was thinking of. This is definitely the Primavenon's hangout spot. You know, it makes so much sense now. Like, now that I'm looking at it, I, like, I, now I can remember. Why am I being dragged up to the surface? Why is that happening? Why do I just grab that starfish? That's probably just such a waste of my life. Well, it's because I need to get some XP so I don't die to death. I saw him have a shark down there, and I don't, I don't know how much damage exactly those do. Uh oh, that thing's strong. I remember that thing. I hate that thing. This looks like a safer area. It's oh, this is my spot. Yeah. This is my spot. I remember this spot. You guys know any episodes I spent sitting in the spot eating. Well, that is the game. It's eating grow fish. And we're officially level 10. And we've hit a thousand coins again. I've made back my money. I'm no longer in debt. Hooray for no longer being in debt. Wrong! Grabbed. Um, there's nothing else over here. But one little starfish. Oh, there's one over right. here. There's one little sponge. Are these like sea, like sponges? Is that what they are? Because that's like the sea turtles eat and saw them eating these. So I think that's what they are, but I can't be sure. Or are they just like coral? But then, like, why is there other decoration coral in the game, but they don't, like, allow you to eat it? Oh my god, that scared me. Oh my god. That scared me so bad, that turtle. I thought it was something dangerous. Whew. The only thing dangerous about the turtle is the fact that, uh... That it eats the same stuff I'm trying to eat. See this starfish? Actually, I don't think it likes starfish. I think it only likes this and sponges. And so far, this has been a pretty solid episode. Almost died to a prognathod. Un um, have done pretty well. Made back my money. This is working out well. But episode one was a doozy. Oh, and also, all of you watching this, all of you that are still watching this, thank you. Uh, I believe it's only 2% of all the people that watch my videos stay after the first two minutes. So those of you that are watching now, congratulations. You are some of my favorite viewers. Because you watch till the end. And all half of you don't click off. I see you about to click off. Don't do it. Bad idea. Trust me. Bad idea. This video is much better than anything you ever, uh, any other video you can watch. 
And trust me, I know I'm thinking too about videos. I make them. Okay, I can devour crabs, can I devour bivalves? Yeah. Yes. That is true, that is factual. I can devour them. Oh, see, you were slow. This game is all slow compared to me. You're the last one, and now you're not. I should have said, now you're done. Man, I missed an opportunity. Um, you're devoured. Level 13, isn't that an unlucky number? Okay, but think about it this way. Is un is being unlucky just not being lucky? Like, isn't that just mean it, you're not lucky? So you're just regular? Like, think about it. Think about it. Think about it. Because un means not. So unlucky means not lucky. If you're not lucky, you're normal. Unlucky doesn't mean bad luck. It means not lucky. Which I know may sound hysterical. So, have you probably been using unlucky is wrong? I was just saying, I wish you luck just means I hope the randomization's in your favor, which randomization can never be in your favor. It's random. It's the point of it. It's supposed to mean luck isn't real. It just. So what we call randomization, and we say some people are better at getting the correct, their favored outcome out of randomization, but it's just, it's just not true. Uh, as my teacher would say, there's only one thing wrong with it. It's not right. Man, the amount of times I got tricked by that, I was like, Hey, what's the, what's wrong with this? And he was like, well, there's only one thing. It's not right. And I would just be like, oh, well, really? No, really? I got an 80 on it. I had no idea it wasn't right. But why isn't it right? Yeah. And then he would say, well, it's not right. Because it's wrong. I was like, well, really? How'd you guess that? But anyway, I think we're about to be level 15, which means... This is... I'm definitely not playing again of this creature. Well, like, not this episode. Because we're already doing super well. The ain't like... Like, remember the English fish episode where I just had to stop it because we had already beaten two of the bosses on the map, and the third one I didn't know where it was. And also at that time I thought there was only two bosses. My mistake. But, so, I'm gonna do something dumb, and we're gonna hope it works out. You know what I'm saying? We're gonna go, like, explore and look for danger, and I'm gonna regret it. Pen damage? Okay, we may be ready to do something. There's also starfish to eat. Oh man, I keep getting dragged upward. Stop doing that, gang. Like, I literally cannot move. But hey, starfish are delicious and that will never change. And bivalves are also delicious and that will also never change. And a sea sponge. Ah, God. I think it's like when I hit the edge, it like glitches me into the rock and it's trying to slide me out. But it's also like pushing me up. So I'm getting messed up. I just can't drive at that point. Yeah, you can eat those. I forget. It doesn't give you a lot of SP, but it gives you some. I feel like it's strange. There's like no animals. A mahi mahi. Finally, vengeance. Yeah. That was pretty good. That felt pretty satisfying, if I'm being honest. Like, that was very satisfying to me. Yeah. 
15 damage, 15 damage, 15 damage. Oh, you're done, Mahi Mahi. Oh, that was a free level. I'm getting stronger. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, those are some of the big sharks. I don't know how strong. I don't know how strong those are. I don't know if I'm strong. And then again, I did just take out a Mahi Mahi in a couple hits. And if I run it, I think I saw 70 damage. I think if I smash into him, I'll do 70 damage right after that. Quick, somebody look up how much health I have. I'm just kidding. I'm far too lazy to do that myself. I don't want to pause the game. That would be terrible of me. Real gamers don't pause games. They don't call tech support when their game breaks. They just turn off their internet and click play. Oh, we have another Mahi Mahi over here. Also, I am the world's biggest swordfish. Or sailfish. I don't know what's when it's classified as in this. I'm pretty sure. I feel like I'm being hunted. Like I hear hunting music. Like what is that? Why does it sound like I'm being hunted now? Oh my god, because I was. You see that? I glitched through the rock for a second. I saw it. There's a shark around here. It was chasing me. Wait. wait. All right, wait. Fly him. Okay. Oh, there you are. Yeah. God. No. 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 <sighs> that was uh. That what? What was that? I don't even think I can play as that. Wait, no, I can't. That was the... Was that the tiger shark? 174 health. Of course I wasn't going to kill that. I only did 40 damage. Oh. oh man, I was hoping that was going to... I was going to be able to kill that. If I had been able to get a couple more hits off and it hadn't hit me there, I would have won. But, you know, that's how it goes sometimes. So next episode, we're going to go for the Ghost Shark that's got Vendor Prey, Tears and Pieces while dealing additional damage. Okay. Activate the Sensory Hills nearby life even through obstacles at cost of some speed due to concentration. So I can, like, if I'm hiding somewhere, I can use the radar to, like, see if there's anyone around me. That's pretty interesting. And then we have, you know, ghost, we have the ghost, hammerhead, tiger shark, and then ithiosaurus. That's the thing that's always ruined in my life. Oh, there's a skin on it that makes it blue. We may use that. Beluga. Another ice creature, narwhal, ithiosaurus, orca. Whale shark, that'll be fun. Dordon. Yeah, this is the thing I was talking about. I can't... Ixipactitans? Titan, Thickius, Dunclosaurus, Chronosaurus, and then the Great White Shark, Prognathodon, and the Megalodon. 6,424 health and 338 damage. That's so much damage. Like, this thing has less health, but it does, like, 200 more damage. Like, I don't know. Like, these are going to be really fun to play. But that does it for this episode. 
So, um, I'll see you all next time. Don't forget to turn off your internet before you play any game.